Okay, in this video, uh, we are going to show you how to upload your files to the cloud. Uh, if you've been selected to be an artist, uh, you've been sent this email, uh, an email similar to this, and uh, in it, it's going to have attachment, a requirement form of what we need. Um, let me show you what that looks like real quick. As, when you open up, it'll look like this. And uh, this tells you what you need to upload to that folder. We need 10 to 15 photos of your artwork. Uh, and it's important that you uh, name the artwork, the title of your paintings. A lot of artists just send their random pictures in with JPEG number 8043. And, you know, and then I got to write them and tell them that you're going to have to tell us what you're captions are because we need the titles in order to put captions in it. Uh, I'll explain that uh, down the road too. Uh, we also need uh, your media. So when you put the name of the title, also put in what media it is. Is it acrylic? Is it watercolor? Pastel? Whatever. I'll explain that as well. So 10 to 15 photos. Now remember, the more you have, the smaller your pictures are going to be. If you want to focus more on a few, just send in 10. Uh, but it's up to you. Also, we need a head and shoulder shot of you uh, so we can uh, promote you as well as your artwork and let people see who you are. Uh, you also have the option of sending in a studio shot uh, of you working in your studio or standing by your artwork or whatever. But uh, that's optional. If we have room, we'll put that in. And then we need uh, a document of... Um, uh, a bio of who you are, uh, 300 words or less uh, about you, just a little bit about who you are, uh, what you, um, maybe your your art history or education or whatever you feel about your art or what, what inspires you, whatever. But we need 300 words about you to put in uh, uh, under your bio. Um, we also need... Uh, to uh, we need your your contact information. We put that in a panel in there. Uh, so in that we need your website if you have one, uh, all your social media sites. I'll give you an examples uh, and uh, your email if you want that in there and your phone number, which is optional. Once you have all that together and you've taken your photos that you want to put in the ten or fifteen, you've renamed them, you put them in a folder, and you're ready to upload them. Um, this form tells you how to do that, but, uh, I'm going to actually show you, uh, how to do that. Now, this is a sample of what we do. So, like I said, your bio will go in here. That's about 300 words right here. A photo of yourself, an optional studio shot, your web page information or contact information, web page, social media. Uh, with the actual links to uh, your social media, and then your 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 pictures, your graphics, uh, and see th that they're named uh, the name, the name of your painting after midnight, the type oil, name of the painting, roadside houses, ink, so forth. So this uh, is how you're going to uh, name the photos that you upload. Uh, so that's a sample of. Uh, of uh, what, yeah, how, how your page is going to lay out. All right. So let's go back to the email. Uh, that requirement form, be sure to open that up and, and go by that. But once you have that together, then you're going to see this. Click on your name and go to the cloud folder to upload files. And your name should be here. Now, I put a sample here for me, but your name should be here. It's in blue or purple, and you click that on. And that's going to take you to Google Drive. We've created a folder with your name on it. So when you open it up, it'll look like this. It'll say your name. It says Jerry here, but it'll say your name. Uh, and you can do one of two things. You can just go grab uh, your folders and drag them here and drop them off from your hard drive. Or you can go up here where it says New. Click that on. Hit File Upload. Click that on, 
uh, and then you'll uh, go to your hard drive and you'll uh, you'll look for your uh, your folder. Let's see, mine's right here. What you're going to do is select your photos uh, as well as your documentation if you have it in there, um, and hit Shift. And that'll select it all. That way you don't have to do it one at a time. You hit Open, and basically that's it. It it's uh, uploading. Let me move this out of the way. This is uploading now one by one, uh, and this will go to the cloud. And then you'll email us and let us know uh, that you've uploaded. And at that point, what we will do is go online and we will download your pictures uh, and your information to our uh, server. And, uh, and then we'll begin laying it out. So notice how we have name and media. Name. Try to do it in this format. Make your name a uh, capital uh what the name is, WC, that's not done right, but capital uh, in your titles and lowercase in your media. And just put a hyphen in the middle. And because what we do is we copy that information and we put that in uh, into those captions, which I showed you earlier. So uh, your bio, all right, just to uh, show you an example of the bio, let me click on mine here. So what you're going to do is... Uh, uh, put your name up here. You might want to put the country you're from. We put that in there. And put your bio information here. Uh, and then below that, just put in your um, your contact information, your web page, and uh, all your links to your social media. And that will go in our uh, social media panel. So uh, send that, please, as a doc file. Do not send it as pages. Uh, I work on a PC, and I'm not able to uh, convert it uh, from pages to something I can extract. Uh, also, please don't send a PDF, because, again, PDF, uh, it's a big process trying to extract uh, the information from a PDF in order to uh, copy that information and put it into our layout program. So try to send it as a doc file. Uh, so. Uh, that's it. Now, you uh, sometimes uh, there's an issue when you're uploading stuff that some people get a message saying that they can't upload because they have to join Google Drive. Now, you shouldn't have to join Google Drive. Uh, you're set up uh, as an editor, so you should be able to upload stuff with no problems. But we found out sometimes that happens. Maybe it's in certain foreign countries or whatever, but, uh, or or maybe people, uh, I don't know, they're not a member. And, and uh, anyway, they try to get you to join Google Drive. If you have an issue, just write me and let me know. Email me and uh, we can sometimes uh, offer you another option to upload your files in a different format or different platform. But at any rate, you should be able to simply go here and hit new and select your files and bring them up here. If you get a message saying you got to join, um, let me know. All right. Well, uh, I appreciate it. That's about it. Uh, again, check this requirement form before you do all this. And since you're done, you got everything uploaded, let me know. Thank you very much. And uh, see you later.